Episode that had the greatest ending of all time. Thank you very much. Unlike some episodes over here. But now we're moving on to uh, Under Night Imbirth X latest. So let's do this. Under Night is easily my favorite series among these four. With Ruby coming out a close second. But I just. Oh, well, Under Night's so great. All right. Really can't wait to see what they do. Here. Hey, Lene? All right, so automatically we start with Hi. What is this place? And. How should I know, oh. you idiot? Uh, okay, what's this rock? Why don't you wipe that me? stupid look off your face and start examining your surroundings? Oh, he looks all right, I guess. Not that stupid looking. He already figured out he's holding a rock and, you know... I don't know. I feel like everything's progressing a lot faster already than Blaze Blue's plot. You never know when an enemy could strike. And yeah, I know. Then we got know. knowledgeable Lene over Why here. Why be so mean? She's right. Oh, and hello, Wallstein. If you get defeated here... That stupid face of yours is going straight into a coffin. <laughs> really, old man? Oh, Can you leave my face, face out of this? Fine. You want me to look serious? I'll look serious. Oh, can't wait for this. Awesome. It's the exact same Hi. it's always looked. Please don't tell me you're serious about looking serious. What? Why do you sound so disappointed? What's wrong with my serious look? Oh, wow. I mean, their characters can only change very minute eye and mouth movements. <laughs> Worry not. The measure of a man is not in his appearance. It's by the by the size of his 18 pack. Good damn! Look at that, Waldstein. It's crazy, dog. It still sounds like I have a face problem. Yeah, you do. Even if you do, a oh. man's worth is not decided by his face, but the size of his heart. Wow, how? Thank you. Gee, this is how effective. you calm someone. <laughs> Wait, who was that? I heard the voice. But I don't see anyone. Hmm. It takes skill to get so close to us undetected. This may be a, <laughs> Maybe worthy, a worthy opponent. opponent. Stop, stop! That's, I don't want to fight! That's funny. Please, put away those scary claws of yours. Oh, I could if I could get out of my render. <laughs> Not only is she formless, I can't even sense her presence. Who the hell are you? Huh. That's a little complicated. I guess you could call me the moderator? Oh, so we get a legit name out of her this time. She seems harmless enough. Yeah, that's how okay, she starts. Okay, moderator. Why don't you tell us what's going on here? Hey, Lene, are you sure we can trust her? Aren't you just telling me to be careful? I am being careful. I'll decide whether or not I can trust her after I hear her explanation. Right now, getting information out of her is all we can do. Already, he's just so much smarter than Rocker. Hey, Ugh. you two! Stop whispering to each other. I have an important announcement to make. You should be able to hear them. She's already pissing me off. <laughs> what? There's the rock that we, we really don't have any other choice. Okay, now that you have all piped down, let me try the title call one more time. You didn't even do it once. Oh, here we go. Welcome to the 37th Keystone. And the number's Scrabble right again. Battle tournament. Let the games begin. Huh? <gasps> Yeah, I know. It's all a little much, but don't worry. I'm feeling generous, so I'll give you a rundown of the rules. Since all of you come from the same world, you'll be a team. Oh. Your job is to protect the Keystone. If you can do that, you can go back to your original world, to Kanzakai. An original team of three to start off with. However, if anyone takes this away from you, you won't be able to return to Kanzakai. I know it's harsh, but them's the rules. Them's the all rules. Alright. I wish you all long, happy, and lucky lives. Alright then. That's it? Yep, that's the whole briefing. You can take it from here. Good luck. What wait a minute! You call that a briefing? You didn't explain Jack! She explained enough. I don't know, a lot more than most people are explaining in this, Done in, talking, in this huh? game. Is that seriously all the explanation we get? You tell us only what you want to, then disappear, huh? What about that stone you showed me earlier, Hyde? The one you found yourself holding all of a sudden? All right, you mean my keystone. This? I'm going to assume that that's the keystone she was referring to. And with the limited information we have, we have no choice but to keep it safe. Ah, clever. We merely need to defeat whatever enemies assail us. Hmm. Hold that treasure close, boy. 
Alrighty. Oh, come on, old man. Wouldn't it be safer for you to hold it? Probably not. Loath as I am to admit it, I tend to get distracted in battle. Should I step on the stone and step shatter on it, the we're stone. all doomed. Yeah, you're pretty, pretty fucked. Although, if this goes as the same as every other episode so far, uh, Moderator is inside that keystone, so maybe you should just step on it right now. Yeah, I've never known you to be terribly delicate. <laughs> Indeed. From the stone is such a tiny thing. I wouldn't trust myself to carry it. Eh, fair point. But are you sure I'm the better alternative? If I lose this thing, we have to say goodbye to our ticket home, well, right? What makes you think you're gonna lose it? Don't worry so much. If you've been able to keep the insulator safe, you can handle the stone. We the reason I keep insulator safe is because I keep it in the palm of my hand and pull it out like a fucking badass. I love it, it does that. My, you're awfully close. I'm a little jealous. Grab it already. Another voice? Who's there? Oh, boy. Oh, did I interrupt? I'd apologize, but I don't know you well enough to care. Bitch. What the... She came out of a hole in space! It appears the voice wasn't lying earlier. I didn't expect our first opponent to be some little girl, though. Oh, you're one to talk, Lene. I mean, you... actually, if anything, Rachel and Lene are very similar. They're both immortal. Do not let your guard down. She may appear to be a child, but her overflowing energy is that of a monster. That Tell she us, is. creature, who are you? Hey, you have all oh, been awfully rude to the princess. Did that toy just speak? Where are our toys? <laughs> Quiet down, Gee. Or do you want to be punished again? <laughs> ah! I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'll use you as my shield in the game. Lily, that's what she does. I'm afraid I haven't introduced myself. My name is Rachel Alacard. I've no interest in your names. So don't bother returning the introduction. Well, fuck you, then. Instead, allow me to ask you a favor. I, I said, fuck you. Uh, <laughs> favor? Indeed. It pertains to the keystone you're holding. Give it to me. You just can't get these from anybody, can That's you, That's more of a command than a favor. Sorry, but you're barking up the wrong tree. If you want the stone, then you better be ready to take it from us. And these are much more confident kids than uh, the Persona cast. Although Hyde's the only uh, kid here. And Waldstein is ages old of warrior experience, and Lene is immortality old of experience, so... <laughs> How stubborn. Well, this is troubling. Whatever should I do? You there. What would you do in my situation? Stop Ooh. hiding and tell me, would you? Impressive. Oh, now so. You saw right through me. Where... Alright, cool. I had hoped to hide my presence completely. But it seems my best efforts fell short. Oh, lower your goddamn gun and stop having a heart attack. What? Another ambush? <laughs> what a lovely day this is turning out to be. Only you could think positively on that. Ambush? Oh, not at all. I'm just a detective. Uh, your gun screams bullshit! Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Naoto Shirogane. Mm -hmm. Charmed. So what are you doing here, detective? Oh, you know, just raising my gun to people and, and waiting for the moment where I do finally shoot them right in the forehead. Investigation, <laughs> of course. With my gun! Huh? Investigation? <laughs> yeah, see, I no I poke the note of my gun on things, and if they move, I pull the trigger and a snap. That's called investigation. You're telling me you're not curious? I wonder how many bullets are in here. Are you not curious? About the workings <laughs> of this world? About the reason we were all brought here? I, for one, want to answer those questions. This detective seems a little odd. Very. <clears throat> anyway, I'm looking for information. If you don't mind, I have a few questions. Okay, okay, break it up! Stop right there! Yeah, you're, you're not even gonna get much out of these two who just got here, mind uh, you. D the voice! Investigation! Looking for information? Give that boring stuff a rest. <laughs> Whoa. We've got okay. all these people hanging around in one place. Why waste time thinking when you could be tag battling? Yeah, why think with your brains teams. where you could think with your fists and be clueless and stupid like me? What's with her? She comes out of nowhere and starts directing things all of a sudden? I see. So this is what she meant by moderator. What a joke. I love Lemmy's voice. No questions voice. allowed, huh? Really the world do. itself is trying to keep us from sharing information. Sounds, she sounds familiar. She probably has been something. some anime I've seen a thousand times. I just don't recognize it. Hey, shut up! Zip it! 
You know what? That's it. You're fighting now. You already have the gun and everything. There's contestant one. Oh, the gun joke is always funny. Uh, no room for negotiation, it seems. Oh, how convenient. Very well. I shall be this detective's partner. Right. Wow, you're quick on the draw. Doesn't sound like you need any coaxing. Wait, are they seriously getting ready for battle? Good. <laughs> what a fine <laughs> idea this is. <laughs> hardly suppress my thirst for battle. Cool, I get you At in there. At least then, someone's right? excited. Come, child. This is a wonderful opportunity to show you how to handle yourself on the battlefield. What? You're dragging me into this? I thought he was talking to Lene. Are you two ready? Then I am happy to announce the kickoff of our first battle. Here we go! Alright, now, I'm actually very skilled with every Undernight character except Wolfstein. I, he Waltzai is the get only guy ready. I don't like, so I mean... Get ready! I mean, don't get me wrong, Waltzai's stupid powerful. I'm just so not into the slow characters. But, we'll stay with Hyde, because I can combo with Hyde. Plus Hyde's my boy, he's good, I like him. Can't oh, escape from shit. crossing fate! Fight! Fight. <laughs> oh, I <laughs> Alright, you gotta do something there, Paul Stein. There we go. Alright, goodbye, Ray Charles. Come on, Nato. Alright, let's bring Paul Stein. Alright, come on. All right, get fucked. <laughs> God, so fucking powerful. He deals so much damage. So, this is the power of another world. A damn, a damn good and underrated world. Well, thank, thank you. They were far more dangerous than I'd predicted. We should withdraw and heal our wounds. What's wrong? Is that all you got? That stone. I'm out of bullets, Be actually. Sure so to yes. Take good care of it. They've escaped. Still, they were very skilled opponents. I especially liked how that detective fired bullets and they didn't even time. pierce my 18 pack. <laughs> Hyde, are you okay? Yeah, pretty much. But their powers. They were like. Like in births. But if they were really in births, I would have been able to tell. I think I know who Lene is. I'm very certain she's uh, Liz from Sword Art. She she has that monotone voice to her that sounds kind of like I, if if Liz were to speak more monotone, it sounds like it would sound like that. For what it's worth, that's her. I could not sense that they had any exist powers. Yep, yeah, nope, not in births. So if they're like in births, but not in births, what are they? Well, should you be able to just tell if people are normal? I mean, there are normal humans in your world. You could have just tell that Naoto was obviously a regular girl. She just had a persona. And there are no, there's no vampires in Undernight, so it wouldn't make sense that you're not familiar with vampires since what Rachel is. And I sense a darkness here, and it's not the Hollow Knight. You, you do know though, the Hollow Knight doesn't happen every night, right? I'm pretty sure it happens like in a cycle of a few months, if I remember the game correctly. Waltstein and I will chase after them. The information they hold is too valuable to simply let them slip away. In the meantime. <sighs> I want you to learn all you can about this world. Um, Roger. But don't push yourself too hard. And not just for the sake of protecting the Keystone. I want us to get back to Kanzakai together. Alive. Oh. Me too. Count on you too, old man. Ha! I will claim the head of the mastermind behind all this <laughs> before you know it. I would very much like to see No that. need to go that far. Just... Find us a way home. Um, but if you're not too busy, could you also grab the mastermind's head? I I I need to mount it. When I'm when I'm sitting at my throne at home, my insulator in my palm and the head above my chair. Right. Better get investigating. So, <laughs> where do I start? You start next time on Beetle Five. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button to leave a comment of announcements to play in the future. And I will see you guys next time. Later!